Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. What I'd like to do is show you how to solve this literal equation for h. And to do that, basically what we need to do is we need to undo everything that's happening for the h. We want to isolate the h. That means get the h by itself. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to circle the h here. And I'm basically going to look at it and say, all right, what is everything that's happening to the h that I need to undo? And this, this problem is usually a little more difficult because you know, a lot of times when we're just like adding or subtracting a number or multiplying just a number, it's very basic. But here, you know, you're multiplying this huge term with multiple variables. But the idea is still going to be the same. Always want to undo what is, what is adding or subtracting to your variable first. Well, you can see. Even though, yes, there's the um, addition sign in front of this, this is positive. So basically, we're adding a 2 pi r squared. So to get rid of the 2 pi r squared uh, on the side of the h, I need to subtract it. So I'll just subtract 2 pi r squared. I need to uh, eliminate the whole term, right? You just can't subtract the 2. You've got to get the 2 pi r squared. You need to do that on both sides. So therefore, I now have a minus 2 pi r squared plus 2 pi, oops, I'm sorry, yeah, a equals, a minus 2 pi r squared equals 2 pi r h. So then again, I'll go back to this and circle and say, all right, again, you're divided by 2y. Uh, two you only need to divide by 2. Keep the y there. You don't want to divide by the y. So now um, I need to look at and say, all right, what has happened to the h? It's 2 pi r, right? So I need to undo multiplying by 2 pi r. All three of these are multiplying by my h, so I need to divide by all three of them. So therefore, I end up with h equals a minus 2 pi r squared divided by 2 pi r. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you solve uh, your literal equation with multiple terms. Thanks.